hit him with the sword. Alright, you wildlings. We'll see you in a few days. I gotta slice you. Take me you in the form of dragons. Samurai. Oh, get a room. Hey guys, I'm happy to announce that our 99 cent Maker's Mob woodworking sale is back. This is our biggest woodworking sale of the year. We're inside the Maker's Mob. You'll not only get access to learn my top woodworking projects, you will also get over 90 woodworking tutorials with plans from YouTube's top makers like Jimmy DeResta, John Heiss, Neil Paskin, Frank Howarth, John Peters, and of course myself. And right now, if you click the link in the description below, we are also hosting a two-month router bit challenge where you can upload your projects that you have made and compete with woodworkers at different skill levels from all over the world in order to win thousands of dollars in prizes from CMT Tools and Tailored Toolworks. So click the link in the description below, learn woodworking from YouTube's top makers, and make sure you take advantage of this sale now because it ends this Sunday at midnight. See you on the inside.
just that if like boats bump into it, it's not gonna like shift that outside joist, you know? It's locked, locked in. So the wind doesn't usually pick up till the afternoon. I don't know why you even keep saying that. The wind just does whatever the hell it wants, whenever the hell it wants. And it seems to just love throwing a wrench into my plans. So we were gonna try and get the dock framed up and floating in the water before the wind picked up, but decided to start early. And uh, as you can see, this is just really awkward with a half sunken dock, big piles of lumber everywhere. So I, uh, I asked my neighbor if we could use his dock, which is a nice big concrete dock with a log boom protecting it and it's not moving at all in this weather. And he said that's okay, so we're gonna go over to his dock, which is got a much larger space, and uh, frame up the dock on top of his dock without dropping everything in the water. And then we'll just put it on rollers and slide it in. Seems really easy, right? Yeah, it won't be that easy, but it'll be easier than trying to do it on this teeter-totter of a pile of wood getting smashed around by the waves. So, let's move over to a better workspace.
Gotta get this flush spot on and we're good for the water, yeah. Make the dust splooking, splooking in the water, yeah. Is that racist? <laughs> <laughs> white people are allowed to make fun of other white people's accents, right? What accent is that? It's like Swiss German. It's European. European accent. What's your heritage? European. Dutch. You can make fun of yourself. Right? I, I, I'm German, I'm okay with I'm it. German, Dutch, a bunch of other stuff huh. in there. It was kind of more Swedish though. Swedish? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Nine? Nine. <laughs> we've got a dock framed up. And we've got some one by eights with little roller pipes underneath it. And looks like we can we can just shove her in the water. Yeah, so we're just kind of implementing the ancient Egyptian way of moving stuff around. Was it even the Egyptians though? Probably the Mesopotamians were rolling shit before them. So before then the cavemen were probably rolling stuff on branches, building their altars and stuff so why do the Egyptians get so much credit it's just it's not fair anyways watch us hopefully we don't wreck anything watch us <laughs> that watch seems us to be put, what you're doing right watch now us put this dog in the water using <laughs> physics <laughs> science got me rolling my dog in Oh, because I'm white and nerdy, white and nerdy. Yeah? <laughs> Rolling my dock in. Oh, gosh. Boards are gone. We did it! We did it. Yo, it's Amos. We built the dock in the crazy, crazy wave. Yeah, we did it. We did it. We did it. Hooray! We put it in the water and nobody died. We did it. We did it. <laughs> Sorry, channeling my Dora. Please make sure to give this video a like and a share and make sure to check out the links in the description box below so you don't miss out on our 99 cent Maker's Mob sale as well as huge savings on all sorts of CMT tools. Make sure you take advantage of this sale now because it ends this Sunday at midnight. See you on the inside. <laughs>